Hey everybody, welcome back. This is Lee from the You've Been Game channel and I'm going to play some Doom 2 for you today. Uh, you can see I'm playing it on the Switch. I uh, just got Doom 1, 2 and 3 on the Switch, bought it this week. Um, obviously, classic games. I mean, for my generation, probably one of the most globally known games, the, the first Doom at least. I think I started on Doom 2, but I can't actually remember. Um, I was a bit late to the party. I don't know. I think I may have played Doom before I played Doom 2, but it was very close to when Doom 2 came out. Um, so I think I remember playing Doom 2 more because it, as it was the newer game, everybody jumped on it straight away. But let's load it up while I'm talking away to you. I haven't played it for a long time, actually. Actually, the last time I played it, I think, was on the PS3 when I bought the trilogy on there. So... There is a possibility I'm going to be a tad rubbish. I've got to set my controller up. I've got a reasonable wireless controller. I like the sticks, but I've been having a few problems with my sticks on the Switch lately. Yeah, my, you know, my Joy-Cons. I want to get some new ones, but I'm not paying £65 for them. So, you know, I'll wait till I can get some in a sale somewhere. Um, I've had like issues with the left stick um, moving up by itself. Apparently, it's a common problem. Um, not particularly impressing to be honest considering I've not had that very long but you know well I had it since launch I mean I was I think I got it the week it launched so I suppose it's been a few years now anyway back to Doom 2 here we go this is the first time I've booted this up on the switch so forgive me if I don't know the options too well um, I don't know if this is gonna piss off any people or whatever but I think I'm gonna probably turn the music off that's how I play Doom normally, I don't play with music on, so um, I don't know if that is going to spoil it for anybody who would normally keep the music on, but I always find it more atmospheric without the music on. Let's just make sure I know what controls are. So yeah, the back trigger is sprint and fire, and I still need to know. Use obviously is A because it's a switch. Okay, I think that's pretty self-explanatory. Okay. Right, let's go back in single player. It's great you can play multiplayer as well, which is really cool. Be a new game. Right, it's only the two levels. I usually go for a middle ground. I don't want anything too hard, but obviously I don't want anything too easy either, because that would just be ridiculous. Is it widescreen? Uh, I was wondering if I can get rid of those bars. But I'll keep it at this aspect ratio, because I don't want to ruin anything. Okay. Are we ready? Let's go. so weird now playing games like this where you can't actually move around the name properly you know you've got to literally move side to side and strafe I mean it's still pretty cool and obviously you can use the sticks now which makes things a lot easier than it used to be I don't think anyone hit me actually just check there's no ammo okay it moves pretty quick I don't know if this is the sensitivity is high let's have a quick look I don't know if there's an option for that or not it's quite high. I'll take it down a notch. I don't want to always run on because it's a bit. Did I actually take it? I think I took it down a little bit. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, look, you can cheat. What's the cheats then? Oh, wow. That's pretty cool. I would never do that. Just didn't see the point in cheating personally, but. Okay, here we go. Oh, I need to be something lurking around here. Anyone here? Oh, where is he? I hear fireballs. <laughs> I see fireballs. <laughs> go and get the rest of these first. Is this a door I can use? Oh, yeah, it is. must have opened something else. What did that open up then? Oh, this. <laughs> oh, yeah, got some armour. This one must open up another one then, I suppose. Oh, that's where we get them down here. Yeah. So we want that sweet, sweet ammo. There you 
kill. I think, I don't know if the sensitivity went down at all, but it, it seems a little bit less. I don't like it, I don't want it too speedy, because it doesn't look very natural. I might just take it down another notch, to be honest with you. Just don't. I don't think it's going to look as good if I'm zooming around at 100 miles an hour. Now that may be a little bit better. Certainly in terms of the video, anyway. I know where you are, I remembered. Oh god, there's two of them there. <laughs> Sneaky buggers. those things. Well, I don't hate them as much in this game as I do in Doom 3. Man, that's a scary game. Oh, they hit me. Yeah, he's firing, but there's one behind me, isn't there? I can't remember seeing that. Whew, a little bit low on ammo. I thought I'd play Doom 2 as well because it's a slightly more intense starting. Doom, the original Doom did start quite slowly. Um, not too many monsters about, and yeah, you know, I don't really. Need, it's not ideal, is it, for a, a short gameplay video? So I don't want to be on here and outstay my welcome. So <laughs> I think this was the better option. There we got seventy-eight percent. I missed a few then, and only eighty-eight percent of items. I must have missed a secret door, I suppose. Yeah, look, only twenty percent. I'm slacking. It's been a while. Keep on the move. There we go. I should probably have left that health actually. For those who don't know, obviously the blue, they're little, they take your health above 100%. Health packs will only ever heal you to 100%. The little blue vials will take you above. I think you can get the shotgun on this level, which I'm looking forward to. A shotgun. I don't want that guy hitting me. There we go. And there is the shotgun. Brilliant. <laughs> I love the, the little happy face he pulls when he picks the shotgun up. Um, probably best to not use that yet, though. Can't move if I can shoot him. Wasted a lot of ammo, but it's probably worth it because you don't really want him rampaging later. Right, go down this little watery tunnel. That's it to the point. How much quicker do you move when you run? Oh, you do move quick. So, don't see the point in sprinting. You move pretty quickly anyway. Seven ammo left. Maybe time to switch to the shotgun, I think. Particularly as I knew he was lurking from experience. Yes, I remembered that bit. Yeah. Oh, there we go. More coming. Wait for him to come to us, I think. Come on. No, he's not better, is he? No, that's fine. Gotta love the shotgun. Yeah, much like the blue vials, these armor things, they take your armor above 100% as well. Or they'll give you 1% of armor if your armor's below. Oh man. <laughs> Wow, I got absolutely destroyed there. Oh, 
Double barrel shotgun there. That did not go well. <laughs> oh no, there's another one. Oof. Ooh. Just about. Wow. Could use some health. Can't remember if you can go back to the original one bullet shotgun. Yeah, you can. That's good. Because with a double barrel, it's brilliant. But you don't want to use too many shotgun shells. It's... There's a few of them in there. Maybe I should have double barreled that guy. Oh, someone's still shooting at me. There's a few of them in there, to be fair. Is he going to come out this way? No, they're going to stay up there. Whew. Don't remember there being that many enemies. These early ones. How do I, oh yeah, that's right. I have to go up. Around this way, I think there's a hidden door or platform or something that's going to take me up there. Oh. Is there not? Oh, maybe. Do you think I would be able to get up there? I must be able to at some point because I've got to get that key card. I've got to go around. Maybe I've got to go around. I know that noise. Oh, oh shh. Where did they come from then? Hmm. Sneak attack. Do I have any health left back here? Because I really could use it. I see that was where. I made that huge mistake of using that blooming health pack when I, only, I didn't really need it. Anything in here? Oh, there's a little bit. No sense risking anything. Uh, can you save this game? Yeah. Let's make sure we do a save. That's done. Okay. Particularly want to have to com completely replay a level. Oh, I keep thinking that's the door. <laughs> that's the door. Okay. Yeah, there's no health in that bit. What do I have to do here then? I actually must admit I cannot remember. Do I press something here? Yeah. <laughs> You can see how long it's been since I've played Doom. Probably there's loads of you out there screaming. This is what you have to do. Do I have to sprint? Maybe that's it. Because I know you can't jump. Maybe you sprint through that gap. There we go. <laughs> yeah, it does come back to you in the end. Just takes a while. And there's my red key. I've got a feeling she has double barrel it because shit could go down when I pick this up. Yeah. <laughs> Does tend to happen in this game when you pick up a key. Oh, we got one of those big red buggers. Don't actually think they can get up here. Oh, there we go. Those things, you see, oh, you hear that noise, that boinging noise. Yeah, those things are... Uh, not fun. Oh, yeah, I could really once again use some health, but. Oh, uh, yeah, thank you. Looks like it was listening to me. Health on both sides. Did I kill this dude? That's where I get this dude, am I? I did indeed. Right. So I think, yeah, back to the red door now. May as well run. Oh, more health. Oh, I'm up a hundred again now. That's good. Oh, man. I don't know what you need sprint for. You do run pretty quick without it. Right, before I go and operate that door, let's just have a quick override. Keep 
keep up to date with the saves because I really don't want to have to uh, replay bits. Okay, what are we going to open now? Yeah, apparently you can look at a map, but I never really used to use the map that much in Doom. Um, yeah, hence it's not the most easiest map to understand, is it? I think it's going to have opened, yeah, this way, that's what I figured. Right, well, double barrel, because I'm not sure what's down here. That guy was easy. A little bit stupid using all those shotgun shells. Yeah, now we need the blue key. So I didn't even explain that before, did I? When you see those doors with the the colours, you'll get blue, red, and I believe there's a yellow one as well. That means you need the key card. Well, you see we've got the red key card down the bottom there. That's what I collected, um, which opened that gate. Yeah, you'll see that often in in Doom. You you you'll more than more than likely um, always be looking for a key card. Which, or oh, you can shoot those barrels as well. Actually, let's do that. <laughs> those barrels explode, so if anything's lurking near that now, it'll get killed. Yep, there was something there. <laughs> that was worth it. All right. Apologies if you can hear the ice cream van outside. <laughs> <laughs> thought that was worth trying to explode that barrel just I figured there would be something going on. who's shooting me now where is that coming from there must be someone in here it's not oh wow it's coming from down <laughs> is it coming from down there someone how is it possible they are shooting me through the walls Don't shoot these bloody barrels. Ah. Gotcha. Ah. Did not go brilliantly. Wasn't expecting them to be behind there. Should have known really, because someone was shooting me earlier, wasn't they? You can still hear noises now. Uh, should we play it safe and shoot those barrels? Might be a good plan. I think that actually injured me then. Oh, I'm full with shotgun shells. Oh yeah, that's a double blue door, wasn't it? Let me guess it can open both of them. Oh. Don't mind using a double barrel on those. There we go. Oh, I got 100% that time. Yeah, 0% of secrets though. So there must have been a secret there that didn't have any items or any kills, because I got them all. Okay. Obviously now we've got the double barreled shotgun, you know this game is not going to get any easier. See something lurking out there. See it just moving slightly. Let's try the old pistol. Always conserve where you can. Anything else lurking around here? No. Okay. And as we can hear fireball dudes, I think we'll double barrel up. Yeah. 
This is a game, Doom, where you do do a lot of doubling back. Now, this is a level that I can actually remember from playing before, where I know you do a lot of doubling back. Because I, and I, I've also, I also remember this level. I seem to get lost quite a lot. So, what the heck? Oh, I, oh, he's up there. Okay, not sure how I get up there. Might be able to sprint across. Let's try that again. Nah, you must get up there from another direction. There just must be blood on the floor. It's just a shame they didn't introduce an up and down, isn't it? I mean, I know they did it in Quake when they released Quake after this, but um, yeah, just the, the ability to look up and down would have made this game, I mean, pretty much unstoppable. I thought something was leaping out of me then. Uh, that's the beginning, yeah, that's where I was at the beginning. Yeah, I'll take your armour, thank you. Now, uh, pistol that. Dude, get the shot lined up. Ah, no, screw it. Could have shot guide him on the gun in there. Uh, shot gunned him. Fucking can't even speak properly. Plenty of shotgun shells are lying around. Can't get in that way. Just wonder where all these secrets are, to be honest. Always double barrel when you go up a ladder because you just don't know what's going to be lurking. Oh my god, there's a load more over there. Oh god, I think it's a bloke with a, like a chain gun or something down there. Yeah, let's retreat for a sec, get some more shotgun shells. Um, only on 47 health as well. Might be time for a quick save. <laughs> Just to be on the safe side. That's what it's there for. Might as well use it. Um, see, look, I'm already lost. Yeah, back up this way. That's good. Got. I think we got everyone. Yeah, you see that now. Look, I've got a, I'll have a new toy to play with in a second. Just get running. Cause... Yeah. Oh. oh man, it's not going well health-wise. <laughs> Save some of that. I'm going to use all that now. That thing there, I think you can only get that later, so there's no point in trying to work out how to get across there. Um, I've got those doing doing monsters, <laughs> as I like to call them. But I know sometimes they're invisible. I hope that's not an invisible one. You really have the health to deal with that sort of stuff at the moment. Yeah, it was invisible. I'm on one health. He got me. God damn it. Okay. Now well, it's going to happen. It's doom. Oh, no, I'm out of shotgun there as well. Oh, that is so unfair. Can we load? Yeah. Thanks. I'm not. I'm not going back there. <laughs> That's crazy. I'm not going back there. Start the level again. Forget it. I think I've done enough. I earned a, a restart there. Oh, 
what that annoying do with the minigun. Oh, it's a chain gun, sorry. Alright. Really could use some health. I don't know if there was any left around here. Probably used it all. Yeah, not doing so good. Oh, there's a bit up there. Oh no, I don't know how to get there. So you got to go through a door. There's nothing at the beginning of the level, was there? No. Okay. Fine. It's great in here. I've got 127% armor, but only like 28% health. Could really do with that being the other way around. Yeah, I think that thing over there is a rocket launcher. <laughs> Thank you for that. <laughs> Load again. Gotta try and make sure I don't get hit. Because that's uh there's obviously no health around this area until I get through it, so Kill them. It's this dude I've got to worry about. Oh, he got me. I wish I knew where that other one comes from. There he goes, just appeared. Where did he appear from? I don't even know where he is. Oh, he's over there, maybe. No, that's a regular shotgun guy. Oh, there he is. Okay. This is hard. Where is he? Ah! <laughs> you sneaky son of a gun. Got him now. I think he's, was he the only one there? Oh, I wish I knew where there was health. Really, really need health. I wonder if I do a separate save and just. I can go over that one, I suppose. Just in case this guy finishes me off, or one of the others finish me off. Yes, I remember he did that. I think he teleported. Yeah, unfair in my opinion. else lurking? Uh, <laughs> I so want to go for the health but you just know that they're going to have a trap waiting for me don't you? Double barrel up. Sprint! Sprint away! Yeah that will do. Sprint and sprint back again. Okay that went better than it probably had any right to do. Something's teleported behind me again. <sighs> so unfair with this teleporting lark. Oh, I think I get that blue key. I get out of here then if I do. Okay, uh, probably better. Well, something else is shooting me. Thankfully, I think that was just a pistol. I want to, yeah, one of you guys in there. Whew, alright. I think now we, <laughs> now we can overwrite that save because, yeah, I mean, better progress there. That was awful. See, the double barrel shotgun 
in my opinion, is not as good as the single because it just takes so long to load. I mean, it will, it, it is more powerful, I'll give it that, but. Um, where's the stupid teleport? That must be that in there. Yeah, go on. Okay. Rocket launcher. Something else teleported, yeah. One of those weenie blokes. Right. I think now I'll go across here, possibly. Be careful because of the sensitivity here. Oh, I know where I am. Yeah, this is the, above the, the entrance bit, those two health packs. This could be the end of the level, but before I go through that door, I'm not going to take a chance just in case. There we go. Yeah, probably a good move. I don't know if they can come over here, actually, those things. See, that's the point. I don't want to... i got a feeling I've got to fight one down the bottom, so I don't really want to waste all my good ammo. Could take forever to kill this thing with a pop pistol gun. I don't care. No, I do care actually. We we got a playthrough to do. I'm not wasting a rocket launcher on it. That's for damn sure. Right. I hope I don't live to regret that when I go down there. See, I'm pretty sure there's at least two of them down here. Yeah, you can see one of them in there. Alright. First things first. What am I doing for shotgun shells? Oh, I'm full. No, I'm not full actually. Right, okay. Yeah, there we go. That's not so bad. Not sure I've ever done it this way before. I've cheesed it. I tell you what, the one thing about playing uh, Doom in HD now is the invisible monsters aren't so invisible anymore, are they? A lot easier to see. Yeah. I might just get down there, this is just like, no good really for. I'll oh, screw it. Thank you. Right, yeah, one more's going to come out of that thing in a minute. Let's get the chain gun ready. Not the rocket launcher. Cool. <laughs> uh, let's make sure I haven't missed anything. Nope. Okay, now I don't know what these buttons do, so once again, be prepared. Oh, that's a lift. Okay, so. And that was what I was fearing. Oh, <laughs> it's like, like magnets to me, they were. Oh, all that for some crappy armor. Oh, what? That's a bit unfair, isn't it? Stashing one of them things behind there. And then 
we go. That's another level finished. Oh, 96% kills. Only 55% of items. That's very disappointing. Okay, I think that's probably a good time to leave it because we must have been going for longer than half an hour, I'm pretty sure. Um, hope you've all enjoyed the video. It's, uh, as you know, Doom 2 came out, I believe, in the early 90s. Um, 92, 93, possibly. Um, unless I'm thinking of the original there, I'm not sure. But they, they did come out around that time anyway. Um, widely regarded as classics by pretty much anyone who's ever played them uh, they were the first games of their kind really um and just a complete revelation i know i fell in love with the first and second and over the later years the third and fourth and fifth or whatever however many there's been now now there's a new one coming out soon i believe um didn't get on as well with the the, the more modern doom um i liked it but it was a bit hectic for me i was a bit like you know I don't know, things were just coming from everywhere and it was freaking me out a little bit. I, I suffer with anxiety and uh, depression, but it's the anxiety side of it more. It's like um, it it just triggered a few things when I was playing it. It was a bit like hectic for me. So if games are like that these days, generally I have to back away from them a little bit. But I will go back to it. I've played it a little bit. But I prefer these. And that's pretty much why I've never finished number three as well. <laughs> that's a different reason. It's not the hectic nature of number three. It's just a bloody scary game, the third one, because you're most of the time you've got a flashlight and you're in the dark, and oh man, it's very scary. But now I've I've got into playing the Resident Evil games and finishing those, I feel probably a bit more uh, confident about maybe going back to them at some point. And well, now I've got them on the Switch, maybe I'll play them for the channel at some point. But I love I love these games, and uh, Doom Two is my favourite without any shadow of a doubt. Okay, guys, well, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you have stumbled across this channel and it's your first view, then I hope you would consider subscribing, joining the gang, and uh, I'm almost up to 150 subscribers now. So, I mean, I'd like to have had more because I've been going just over a year, but the channel's growing um, a little, steady by steady, sort of like, you know, in the last few months, and um, mostly thanks to uh, the amazing retro game community that I've uh, I stumbled across, and... Um, and um, yeah making some good friends on there and um getting some nice comments and feedback from people and hopefully them well i know they're they're spreading the word because obviously people are finding the channel more and more now from the retro gaming community and so i really do appreciate everybody that's given me a leg up um, a mention you know i've had to um, a couple of people shout me out and stuff so which is cool because it obviously does drive people to the channel and i'm not doing it for money i'm not doing it for fame i would never want to be famous not with my anxiety but i do like what i do and i would love more people to see it and comment and hopefully enjoy what i do because i put a lot of effort into these videos and um, they take a heck of a lot of editing so you know as any of you youtubers out there probably know you know i'm not i'm not saying oh i do woe is me i do more than anybody else i know there's people that do things way more complicated than what i do but um you know it's just nice it's, it's disheartening when you put a video like i just put a resident evil 2 video up now i know that obviously the, the remake's been played to death by people it's been out for months and that but you know most of my playthrough of that it's got about four or five views and that's it and you know, it breaks your heart a little bit, you know, when you see that and you put all that effort in and you're really the only person that watches it. But, you know, it's weird because I don't care in some ways because I'm proud of what I've done and it's quite nice to go back and watch myself play the games and have the memories. I wish I could have done it 20, 30 years ago when I first started gaming, but um, you still would like a few more people to see your channel, but, you know it is what it is but anyway if you've got if you do stumble across it and you do join in and you know subscribe please hit the bell as well you'll know when my new videos come out and uh if, if you've got any mates or anybody else uh, that's interested in retro gaming get them involved um i'd love to hear from all of you um you know tell me any games you want to see me play on the channel any of your experiences in retro gaming and anything you want to talk to me about i'm always happy to have a yak about gaming always so you know drop those comments in and uh Let's keep this community growing. And obviously, if you uh, if you know of anybody else, that, if you can recommend any channels to me, I'm always up for watching more retro gaming. So drop them in the comments. Okay, guys, I've witted on enough now. I'm going to end this video. Thanks so much for watching. Take care, and I will see you on the next one. Bye for now.